So growing up, I did not feel like God could use me in day-to-day tasks. I didn't feel empowered enough for Him to be able to work through me in everyday things to touch people's lives. I felt like it had to be a grand gesture. I had to, you know, work in some other capacity in, in order for Him to be able to use me. The church environment that I grew up in, I believe that we focused a lot on the scriptural stories and the Bible stories you know, be the prison stories, the lion's den, things of that, there were not an opportunity to talk about how God could use us in present day circumstances. I know Branson spoke a message in which he talked about how you know if it's the Holy Spirit speaking to you and some of the ways it would be a spontaneous message, you know, it, it would help other people and it certainly wasn't a thought of you and that it could, God could use you in simple ways. It could be a very simple gesture. So recently I decided to go to a nail salon and just kind of spend the day there getting some things done. And one of my main focuses was just to be quiet, to not be on my phone, but to be still and just listen. And I hear the Holy Spirit say, pay for her. And I survey the people around me and I immediately know who it is that I'm supposed to be paying for their services. My first conversation back was, this woman's gonna think I'm crazy. I'm not gonna volunteer to pay for a stranger's service. She's gonna think I'm nuts. And then I was like, you know, I'm not gonna be that way. Okay, you want me to pay for her services, but how are you going to use me paying for someone's services at a nail salon? How is that gonna work? And almost as soon as that thought completed, I thought, you know what, I'm not gonna question you, God. If this is what you want me to do, I will pay for her services, not a problem. What I wasn't prepared for is when I told the lady that I was going to cover the cost of what she had done that day, she almost began arguing with me about why would I ever want to do that. And I just sat there for a minute, and the only thing I could think to say back to her was, when God asks me to do something, I do my best to listen and respond, and that's what I was doing that day, that I felt led by God to pay for her services. Um, But she turned to walk away to leave the salon, and she came back to me and asked me if I knew that it was her birthday today. And I said, I didn't know it was your birthday, but God always knows it's your birthday. And I just thought it was important for her to know that while I didn't know, God was trying to reach her. He wanted to know she was not forgotten and that He was there and He was present with her. I think the most powerful takeaway from this experience is not that I was able to do something, but that God was able to use me in a simple way to make a profound impact in someone else's life.